Hey guys, Leyland here, and I've seen some comments around asking questions whether Pokemon Bank is fully functioning or not. Of course, if by chance you guys have not downloaded either Pokemon Bank or Pokemon Transporter, I'm afraid to say that those apps are lost forever. Oh no! Because we are no longer able to purchase anything off the eShop, that's no ability to download anything either. That is, of course, if you've already bought it. You'll still be able to re-download things at least. Anyways, let's find out if Pokemon Bank is fully functioning. Because honestly, I am curious myself because I have not done it in a while. I'd assume that the apps still work, allowing us to transfer our Pokemon over from the games to bank all the way to home. Yippee! For Pokemon Transporter, of course, use for Generations 5, Black, White, Black 2, White 2, as well as Generations 1 and 2 titles released on the 3DS Virtual Console. While for Pokemon Bank, that includes all 3DS games, Generation 6 X and Y, Generation 3 Remakes, Oras, Generation 7's Sun and Moon, Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. So you guys, here I am, pre-recorded with all of this stuff just to show you guys that Bank is still fully functioning, where you can move Pokemon from your games still to Bank. I jumped on my copy of Pokemon Ultra Sun and I'm going to be moving this Zora over. So now we're going to be transferring over to show off the transferring of Zora from bank to home. The process is a little hard to do with just one hand, so I'll just go ahead and skip the inputting of the code. And after doing all of that, Zora does get sent to home. And there it is. Truff the Zora. What a weird name. I'll just send it to Pokemon Scarlet and I will show you in game. And there it is, my Zora from Ultra Sun moved to bank and then transferred to Pokemon Home. That hopefully shows you guys- Ah! Alright, come on Tauros, don't be like this, please, no, no! Alright, let's try and bring Zora out again. Why? Chill! Tauros! Jesus! Okay, that was fun. No one wasn't. So there you have it you guys, hopefully this shows you guys that both Pokemon Bank and Transporter are still fully functioning. The servers of course for 3DS and the Wii U will be shutting down on April 4th in just a couple months. So you still do have some time to transfer everything over. They do say that you'll still be able to use them after the shutdown, but there is no given date for how long, so I will say this, do not sit on it. I'll also go ahead and do an update video for this, either a day or two after the shutdown, just to test if things are still fully working. So I do hope you guys found this video helpful. If so, be sure to smash that like button. If you are new and you enjoy Pokemon content, then consider subscribing to the channel, as I make videos like this covering Pokemon content and more. Not to mention, I am aiming to reach 10k subscribers by the end of 2024. My name is Leyland, and I will see you guys in the next video. I so totally want to shiny hunt you. Alright, later guys.